Welcome to the JKA Star Wars Podcast, brought to you by JKAgear.com. Go check it out for all your sweet Star Wars swag, news, and swag. Said swag twice, because they have such awesome swag. Today on the podcast, we have Macalupo. Amanda Alrich. Brandon Winfrey. And Kevin Burke. All right, so we just had our first Force Friday a few weeks ago. So, as always, we are a timely podcast, just right there with so the on thick time. of Star Wars news. Like three uh, or four weeks yeah, late. Yeah, right. right yeah, exactly. There. Exactly. Uh, which we like saw a release of all these new Star Wars toys. So today on the podcast, I want to talk about Star Wars toys, merchandise, board games, pretty much all the good physical Star Wars stuff that you can physically touch. All the, the things that kids get to do that we exactly. should get but do, do anyway. Too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, now uh, we have the money to purchase these things. So it's so I know. Yeah, it's, it's almost. It's, so now yeah, we it's get almost it all rather than just one. Yeah, yeah all, mom and dad. I want to get everything I want. podcast money that we get. <laughs> all of it. Uh, that's sweet, that's sweet, sweet, sweet podcast, podcast money. Wait, you guys Keep don't get it in. So what I want to <laughs> start with is actually an idea Amanda had, a wonderful, wonderful game that we're going to play. Because some of these toys, I won't use the word ridiculous because they're awesome, but are ridiculously awesome. They, they, they are nuanced. So uh, Amanda, I'm just going to throw it over to you for the game. So I looked up a bunch of ridiculous Star Wars merchandise that is available for purchase, and I came up with um, some of my own ideas as well. Now, I tried to Google them afterwards every single time I came up with an idea because I'm sure some of them actually might have existed, <laughs> which it came up that way. Um, so if anything I say is false and you prove that that merchandise is real, please <laughs> comment below and send the link so that I now know that that is something I yeah. can buy. Or create it yourself. There or you go. go out and kickstart that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Please well, 3D actually, print us no, any As art. long as you give me some of the money, because it was my idea. Yeah. Um, <laughs> or anyway. send us a free so, one. So, rules of the game. Rules of the game. I'm going to ask everybody whether they think this is a real product or a fake product. Okay. And we're going to keep score. So, Kevin, Goof. can you keep score over there? Oh, hell yeah. What happens right. to the loser? I can count. Who told you I couldn't count? <laughs> I don't know. We can decide a loser. <laughs> yeah, Kevin could totally count. I we, can count. We gave him a test before we started. We uh, did. I used my hoofs. Yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> Who knows those <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Ed <Quantra>. Horse Rats. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, no, horses what count. Was it? What happens to the loser? What happens to the loser? Uh, man, you lose such points. a dangerous question. I don't know. Maybe we Comment throw below it out to the, yeah, how we What do you want the loser to do? Punish we'll the loser. Yeah. yeah. Unless yeah. the loser's me, then don't comment. Comment, especially if it's Matt. <laughs> All right. So uh, you're going to name a Star Wars, hypothetical Star Wars toy. We're going to decide if it's might real be or not. It might be real. All right. Cool. All uh, right. Are you guys ready? Yeah, let's yep. hear it. For the first one. I'm not ready. Don't look, because I did write the answers on my cards. Okay. Um, a Death Star umbrella. Brandon, go first. I think that exists. That's, uh yeah, I'm going to go with that exists, too. Oh, I do want to go opposite just to get an early lead, but I'm not going to metagame it, and I think it exists. True. It does exist. Oh yeah. yeah. All right. We're all on There's the board, everyone. There's actually a whole bunch yes. of different types of umbrellas. They have lightsaber right. umbrellas. Get they have... I feel like Death Star makes sense. Lightsaber umbrella. Well, not yeah. so much. That should exist. Oh, never mind. It uh, it automatically makes sense. Right, right, so right, right, what's right. Yeah, but what's the top, the top part? What? What's the top part of a lightsaber umbrella? The force. But yeah, obviously. It's just clear Shut and up. you're using the force I don't like to that keep at out all. the rain. I, I like don't it. like that. <laughs> and if you and if it doesn't work, it's like, well, you don't you don't have enough metachlorians. Yes. And that's sorry. their excuse. <laughs> By the way, you can buy metachlorians on jkgear.com if you don't have enough. Oh, you can't. Wow, you great. can't. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> I don't know. You can I buy metachlorian metachlorian cream that you apply. See, I, I immediately redacted my lie. Why are you following it up with another lie? Because midichlorian cream is hard to say, but also an enjoyable treat. All right, round two. <laughs> yeah, We're round two. Wow. Next one. Uh, Starlack toilet. Oh, oh. Starlack. Starlack, Starlack toilet. I want it to exist. Does it exist? No. No. I'm going to say n no, but I really want it to. I'm going to say yes. It's some sort of Starlack toilet thing must exist. It is... It does yeah. not yeah. exist. Ah, yeah. Although there was a toilet cover that you could put that said this is not a crap. Oh, oh. That's yeah, but, but, but that if, was not the. It, it would be like seventy-five percent of the time. Shouldn't it say it's well, a crap? Hold on. <laughs> 
You know, you can put the Brandon, lid down. I think you need to see a doctor if 75 <laughs> You are either going too much or not peeing enough. It's <laughs> one of the two so I is think happening right now. I sweat it all out. I think Brandon and Kevin have two. And yeah, I know. Yeah. I'm the one. Exactly. I'm According to my I'm count. Losing. By the way, yeah. uh, can we just talk about this Sarlacc toilet? The teeth would... I wouldn't, I wouldn't sit on that toilet. Yeah. I what, think that, that would be a terrible. really <laughs> terrible thing. Brandon, to what like word did you want to say? Guess. I mean, <laughs> no, the teeth would ridicule you. You call that a butt? <laughs> that's not a butt. <laughs> Sorry, uh, wouldn't it kind of sound like <laughs> ridicule? There's another word that sounds like ridicule. Uh, tear up. <laughs> <laughs> you know that phrase that sounds like ridicule. <laughs> and round three. <laughs> round three. A uh, C3PO coffee machine. Ooh. Uh, I'm going to say, go first. Should, yeah, you go yeah, first. Yeah, so yeah. I'll go first. Let's I'll go first. I'm going to say false. It's an R2-D2 coffee machine. Oh, <laughs> That's I'm going to say trick question. true. I'm going to be so upset yeah, if I'm, I'm gonna, so yeah, I'm gonna go with at true this on that game. One. Yeah, because I feel like he drinks espresso. Like if, if C-3PO drinks like something, if it would be espresso. there's anyone who's constantly wired, yeah, robot. I can I, see him having an espresso cup in his Sure. So what I'm trying to consider in my mind zone is your brain. what it would look like. A coffee maker, a C-3PO coffee maker, right? Yeah. C-P-3O. Um. Oh, yes, sir. Here is some coffee. What? Uh, I'm just thinking <laughs> about the physical look of it. You guys ever seen Princess Bride? That scene where Vicini is trying to like like figure out something's just stalling. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Brandon. Yeah. No, no, no. That's Brandon. Okay, I He's the will. Sicilian. What was your yeah. final answer? I was a little unclear. Uh, Never get involved in a land war with Asia. False. <laughs> <laughs> so false. 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 True. No, no, wait, no, no, I said no, true. No, no. Sorry, I said true. You're, you're, true. I said you're true. bad at keeping score. True. <laughs> I never said I could count. I said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I said I could count. So it's it's false, true, false. Okay. Yes. So this ended up being true. I thought I yeah! made it up. Yeah. I thought I made it up, and then I looked Kevin's it up, off to and a there wait. was a C three PO coffee machine as long with a Darth Vader coffee machine. Wait, are you sure? No R two D two coffee machine. That's mm. pretty. Mm. That's beep, there might beep, be one. Beep. I might have not seen that one. It's angry. I'll okay. give it to you because we're both on, we're both losing now. No, 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 we're tied. No, because no, I, I you're, won. you're beating me. What's the score, yeah. Kevin? Yeah, yeah. What's the score? Okay. He's the winning. score is three for me, two for Brandon, one for Matt. I'm just oh. letting you guys win because it looks bad if the host wins. Yeah. Sure. I, yeah. I thought you were going to be a shoe in. By far, you yeah, have no, the I, most I, I, toys. I know, of all I of definitely us. do. Can <laughs> I ask a question? What? Are you sure this wasn't a one off thing that some fan made? And it was like four purchases. Doesn't that if count, you could though, if I could buy now, it. All I did was if you could purchase it online, okay. then I you was could I was just existing and not a fake item. Brandon's okay. upset that he's lost a point. No. So yeah. he's like, well, no, no, let's no. let's recount this. No, I am all right, round four. Yeah, round four. Yeah. A Princess Leia bun phone cover. Oh. A Princess uh, Leia bun phone cover. So like if you hold it up to your ear, right, you have a like bun there. Going first this time. Uh, I'm going to say true. I'm going to lead off real hard with true. Oh, uh, now I understand. Because you're holding it up, and now it looks like a bun. Yep. Mm -hmm. But without another one, it just looks kind of silly. The yeah, visual in my head. Bun. Yeah. Bun. Brandon? I'm going to say truth. I need to pull ahead, so false. It is false. I made that what? one up. <laughs> Seriously? Yes. That's a good idea. Amanda, you should wow. kickstart that. You should yeah. patent it. You can't yeah. kickstart it. Okay. All right. So now we're... Uh, it's I'm Tyler Brandon. Yeah. So it's uh, two, 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 three. two, and three. Great. All right. Next one. Slave Leia troll. You know, the little trolls with the hair. Oh. oh. That seems so uh, specific. I don't I think you made uh, it up. I will I will start. I'm going to... Oh, man. I'm going to start off with a false, not give a reason, because I know I'm right. <laughs> and I don't want to give yeah, them my awesome reason. Yeah, it seems so specific. I don't think you made it up, but maybe you did because it's so far fetched. I'm going to say it's true. I'm going to go with <laughs> correct. It Wasn't that an option? So true? Yeah, is true? That true? Yeah. It was made up. God oh! damn it. Oh! No. Uh, I've seen Matt, images of that. tied for the lead. I'm, I've seen images back of in that the game. online. I'm I, back in again, the game. Again, if you find it, I could not. I Google searched it. I did not find it's, it. It, it exists. was my idea. No, hold so on, hold on. Up. I'm now tied for the lead. Amanda, this, this is great. <laughs> this is good. This is good stuff. I think Guys, it exists. I had such an early lead. Oh, no. Uh, I'm falling yeah. apart. Yeah. I come All back. Right. I'm back. How, how many cards do we have total? I have 18. So if all right, let's go through quick rounds. Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do good. All right. Jabba the beanbag chair. Uh, true, true. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, I want that to be true. True. Because you could dress up as Slave Leia on Jabba the beanbag <laughs> I chair. I got to say that's true. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, it is 
false. Oh. Although, although, although there's you a little bit of all of us. Yeah. With this one, they actually had uh, sent out this design and it didn't get picked up. So it was like an official merchandise oh, wow. that they were going for. That's what I read online. Um, so this one did. I didn't create on my don't own, but I saw it. I saw a drawing of it, but it does not exist to my knowledge. So yet. Okay. Okay. Oh, yet. Let's say what are, what's it? We're at three, two, two. It's it's three, three, two. Three, three, two. All yep. right. So maybe three more rounds. We'll do yeah, three we'll rounds. Do three more let's rounds. Do three rounds. Good, because this one's my like favorite okay <laughs> tauntaun sleeping bag mm. oh a true because i want one yeah i'm gonna go with true true it's true yeah, yeah, yeah. i was I've just so seen excited that. when I've i saw that, that online. does it smell like, bad does it have that on the inside i've actually seen it because the zipper is a little lightsaber yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> it's so pretty tiny. great yeah. imagine if tauntauns were real like imagine if they had like cow sleeping bags you just like that you would like had a red zipper just crawled into it's gross right <laughs> No, I think it's Oh, fun. you mean making the Tauntaun real? Yeah, like it if gross. it was a real animal and that sure. was like a toy that existed. Yeah, I guess that's true. It's weird, but I love yeah. it. R2-D2 Aquarium. I love aquariums. <laughs> I'm going to go... first. And yeah, I'm going to go with... Uh, false. I'm going to say it's false. Uh, Brennan. No, Matt. Okay. <laughs> I think it is true because R two D two can do anything apparently except make coffee. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go false. It is true. God, <laughs> the Matt's lead is the lead. mine. I think that the host oh. shouldn't win. What? All right, so now we're four three yeah. two. Four three two. And this is yeah. the last one. This is the last round unless it ties up. Are we'll we just gonna make this one worth two points? Sure, let's make it and two then, points. So Brandon has a chance to tie. Oh, we should do. Sorry, I should we go last. We have two more. We, we, more just, we did one more. Oh, we have two more rounds. Three more rounds. Thank you. Two more rounds. So All this right. next one will be one, last one will be worth two. Okay. Okay. Or we could just make these next two worth two. No, that's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Darth Vader fireman figurine. Oh, oh man. Oh, he does look a lot like a fireman now that I think about uh, it. I know he said these are going to be quick rounds, but I have to think about that. Well, Brandon, you haven't gone first in a while. I'll shoot first and say true. Matt? I also think it's true, just because people like making things that aren't firemen look like firemen. All right, I'm going to go false. I need the points. Oh, no. The answer is false. No! Yes! It's actually a Darth Vader no! cup, though, <sighs> and so I just switched it to firemen because I thought it was fun. Yeah. <laughs> for this, for <laughs> That's this really round, good. I need to Amanda's go Amanda's really good at this game, guys. Okay. Because I think the person in last should go last, so they can kind of assess. Okay, sure, so now sure. I have... Wait, it's, now it's four, 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 two. Four, two. So last I one's mean, worth two points. two points. That way, Brandon has a chance to tie. <laughs> oh, sorry. Wait, wait. It's five, five, three. God, I have so many. Oh, sorry, five, Kelly's five, keeping count. All right, five, I don't five, three. Director Kelly, is it five, five, three? Yes yeah. or no? Yeah. That okay. Matters. Five, five, three. <laughs> All right. Still, still two points. Yeah. Yes. Here we go. Jawa Garden Gnome. A oh. Jawa Garden Gnome. So wait, so Brandon oh, goes no. first? No, 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 no he's I go going last. last. Okay, got it, got it. <laughs> I feel like I'm just going to force Kevin's hand because he's going to have to go opposite me. No, uh, he doesn't. He doesn't have to. Uh, but then we're going to have to do a tiebreaker round because we know you're going to get it wrong, Brandon. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to say true. Yes, true. Absolutely. Why not? The garden gnome industry is a huge industry. <laughs> yeah, Matt, if you're it, the garden gnome industry. To, it has to have merchandise. <laughs> so, yes, Jawa garden gnome. I bet there's a whole bunch of garden gnomes Star Wars themed. I'm going to go false because I think if I bet there's an R2 D2 garden oh, gnome. Oh, you're thinking she's tricking me up with Jawa. Yep. You already oh, gave your answer, Matt. You're locked in. No. I'll say false. Whoever Brandon sides with is wrong. <laughs> false. Up, oh, you're. Wait, did I say false? I you said false. <laughs> you said false. Up, oh, Kevin's wrong. I win. Not. Yep. Yeah! <laughs> really? It's true. Brandon! Yes, yes. Why did you do that to me, Brandon? <laughs> yes! No. Brandon! Man. This Woo! is. I, I think I have such an active imagination da, that I think da, it's true. Da, 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 Stop it. Right. Da, it's not your theme song. Da, 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 you don't da, get a medal at the ceremony. Da, 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 da. You're a, you're a Wookiee. But yeah, he didn't get a medal. It's oh, weird. way it's to make it <laughs> sad that Chewbacca didn't He's a walking get a carpet. Didn't. You don't give a carpet to your ground just for holding you up, do you? What? You don't. What? Uh, does the ground. <laughs> did I mix up my words? <laughs> <laughs> you give do, you, do you listen to yourself when you talk? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. I right. listen back at the podcast yeah, and I'm yeah, like, oh, okay. I made Wait. some good points. 
<laughs> and that's all he we're not. We're not going to deconstruct that. Amanda, thank you so much that for that game. That was a great game. game. That hey, was great. Guys, hand for Amanda. I like it that because awesome. I won. Yeah, hand for Amanda. Yeah. yeah. I only like games And let's, win, uh, Matt, let's so applaud the winner as well. Good job, Shut up, winner. Matt. I don't want to hear Good about it. Good job. No. Hey, Matt, there's a winner. first time for everything. So. Yeah, there is. There yeah. is. Yeah. Let me have this, All guys. right. We have to play this game again sometime because uh, this is really fun. All yeah. right. So I want to I want to take it. Yeah. We I love this game. I could do a spinoff of just like couple more if we wanted to later we should do this sure. we should do the same sure. and we should also i mean this is we're just pretty much having a production meeting right now but we should also <laughs> do this with extended universe does this exist oh in the extended universe? that's really good or doesn't this exist in the universe? you could have uh michael make that game. Yeah, yeah yeah so comment yeah. comment uh other ways you like, want to see this yeah like comment some true or false in the comments and we'll see if we can guess it yeah Ooh. As well. yeah. yeah absolutely um, can you not grab my chair? All right, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna. We oh, <laughs> <God>. personal question. <laughs> I wish it? we had a commercial break because be like, hey, we'll be back after <laughs> this commercial to deal with that. Also, for the audio people who are listening, for <laughs> just Chewy, that's a doll. There's a that doll. Amanda has. Yeah, yeah. There was, I guess, yeah. a, a plushie. A pl- it's definitely not me, an it's action a, it's figure. A, no, you can't. Yeah labeled as an action figure anyway speaking of action figures dolls and plushies um i want to talk about uh, we're just about to get like we're coming from a silly game and we're going to get a little bit cerebral i want to talk about this i've been told repeatedly that it's boring and i shouldn't talk about it but i'm not listening so uh, he's going off the rails people as we know like star wars kind of birthed merchandise like the idea of merchandise and merchandising toys did not exist in such a huge form until Star Wars. I think everybody's kind of familiar with the famous story that I think it was Kerner, right? Kerner the, was the initial toy company of Star Wars. Okay. That there was this initial toy company yeah, in Star Wars, so. and they sold out so fast and they couldn't meet demands by the time Christmas was rolling around that they sold cardboard cutouts of the toys so it was like here's an iou for wow. the toys and then they just sold out of the cardboard cutouts of the toys so yeah at the beginning yeah so for for star wars such is anybody still toys. waiting on their cardboard <laughs> <cutouts? laughs> replacement that's probably toys? worth more than the action figures. yeah the cardboard cutouts yeah. now yeah are worth more than the original probably. action figures that that that's probably true uh yeah just imagine being a child on christmas opening a cardboard cutout and then being excited, like not even <laughs> like this. This wasn't like, a, oh no, where are my toys? Like being like, pumped. Yes, someday I will get the actual <laughs> Star Wars toys. This is a promise. So what I want to talk about is, I think we know how much that that like toys have been influenced by Star Wars. I feel now that it's come full circle that now the the toys are influencing star wars that when people are writing the script and when execs are seeing the script they're like uh but what about the toys so bb8 was only yeah. in the movie because they knew they could sell it as a robot to people is Do that what you're trying to say yes that's that's exactly what i'm saying is that a point you're making or is that an example I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I, I thought I was about to hear, yeah, yeah, this is, uh, Disney didn't want until it could be a toy Well, I, yeah. I do know that this is not, so for Return of the Jedi, the planet they're supposed to go to is not supposed to be the forest moon of Endor. It was supposed to be Kashyyyk, the Wookiee planet. Oh. But they didn't think that Wookiees would sell as many toys as the fuzzy little Ewoks. Really? So they, yeah. So that was originally supposed to be, and George Lucas changed it because he knew that Ewoks would sell more toys than Wookiees would. Because they'd had wow. Wookiees for a long time, and yeah. just they but knew how, how Wookiees how sold. How they would sell. So they could extrapolate. It's like, well, we're not going to sell many more Wookiees. Exactly. We do this. However, if we make them shorter and cuter. Yep. Which is, again, Ewoks are pretty much you scaled down a Wookiee. Yeah, yeah, you did. Yeah. You, it's all yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah, you exactly. made it you fatter. Made it and fatter. Yeah, yeah. That's true. That's your, that's funny. I've heard that it was budgeting reasons that they couldn't afford. That but much like they could costumes? afford. But by, <laughs> by, by the costumes? sixth movie, like <laughs> yeah. right yeah. By, by episode yeah. six, they had what they wanted. They, they must have had enough money. So you're right. It must have been toys. That's yeah, crazy. No, it's a, yeah, and that's why they made two made for TV movies with Ewoks. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Oh, they did. I don't know they if that's did. why, but they definitely they definitely did. I yeah. think it was to. I think yeah, they, I think Ewoks sold really well, and that's why they did the TV show and yeah. the made-for-TV movies. Wow. Wicked man, yeah, Wicked, 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 Wicked talks in those movies, and it is like Satan entered his lungs. Yeah, do you know? Do you know what he's talking about? 
they made oh, no, two movies. Sorry, they I... made two movies centered around Ewoks. Uh-huh. So like the Ewoks, and then it wasn't even like stormtroopers attacking. It was some weird yeah. third party well, villain. It's like the first like witch sisters or yeah, something. Yeah, it's, it's odd. <laughs> There's a lady who changes her ring and she turns into a raven. Like it's almost like an episode of Power Rangers. What? Yeah, yeah. So this is, I guess. I need to. See we'll this. talk about this one time. This, this yeah, should be a whole. This yeah, this should be a whole, whole thing. Yeah. Separate thing. Uh, but, but Ewoks, yeah, Ewoks are like yeah. the first, or were, were the biggest decision, uh, at least the first big decision that Star Wars made based on merchandise that had this like, oh, they we're going to change the movies because this will sell more toys. Sure, sure, I can see yeah. that. I think, so it's like, obviously, like, when you look around, you look at the, the current Star Wars Black series coming out, they have taken anything that has appeared in one shot of that movie and made it into a toy. Mm-hmm. And a lot of that comes from the extended universe with them, like, just wanting to base everything off the source material of the movie. So it's like, a lot of these toys do have huge backstories to them, whether it's like IG-88 as a bounty hunter or, yep. like, Greedo as, like, a green person coming in not i mean green as an inexperienced <laughs> not green as a rodian species but anyway i i think in the new movies we're gonna see a lot more of an ensemble piece than necessary than than uh four five and six so are. also let me get this also clear you're thinking mm-hmm. that the movie is actually just a platform to sell more that no, is actually what we're going for i guess no i'm not saying that's all that's the end all be all of the movie but i'm saying the toys are now influencing the movie in a way like i i'm thinking they're okay with more characters like at the beginning there were yeah. kind of only like there were the three main characters and then you had like a handful of supporting characters and i think now we're going to see a lot more main characters cuz that's going to drive toys I, I think on the flip side of that too i think if there's a situation where they're like they're going through a town or something like that and they're, um, and they're basically like, oh, we know that this to add another CG character or something like that, or to add another character in the back of this that's a crazy alien, it will cost X amount of money. Where normally yeah. it would be like they'd be like, oh, I don't know if we have that in our budget, but if, but I bet they're thinking, no, we can make that a toy, yeah. and easily make the money back. So yes, put as many random things in the background as you can, just so we can yeah. have more merchandise. The consumer? a little bit if you're having so many things i mean do you they do it now i mean yeah. well i would say that so yeah. so we're also talking about a, a sure. an ip that's been around for 30 years or yeah. almost, almost 40 years now mm. um that is had time to grow and percolate and so we all know who greedo is or we all know who greedo is right you know, greedo's yeah. barely in there. Yeah. yeah so he's barely in the movies in one yeah, scene sure. Uh, but because we've had so much time to yeah, yeah so much time to talk about it and know his backstory and that sort of thing we now, you know, we have Greedo action figures. I don't think you'll see something that immediate from this movie, but you will see, I think what you're talking about is there are going to be characters who are just designed to be good action figures where they do some one thing that's really cool mm. that is like kind of sums up their character. Sure. Like so you're Bo- Boba more Fett like is like iconic. Like, yeah, yeah. Yes. Like we're going to see set. more Boba Fett. Yeah, Fats. like henchmen and stuff like that who yeah. are, again, they have one cool feature that's like, oh, I would want to play with that action figure. And actually, like, like we've already seen, like we've seen three different troopers like we yep. have the standard stormtrooper the first order and then we have a flame trooper now right yeah. yep like we have yeah. a flame trooper and th- did they just rehash the snow trooper i think they just we just have a snow trooper that's okay got rehashed. it yeah so it's like already we're seeing like i think did we see multiple troopers in the first movie and uh i don't know in the first movie i, I think we did because I, I mean i think hoth saw, was kind of the was yeah was sort of like was a big that, like, oh they have different uniforms but we did see sand troopers like we saw sand troopers in the guys with the orange thing here is was that added in the in the I, that might have been added in the special editions i'm not sure yeah it might have been i think that was added in the special editions. oh this is horrible i don't remember but yeah, terrible yeah, person. Why are you I hosting know. this We're, podcast? I know. Yeah, I know. Matt, <laughs> so you're not qualified to speak on this. No. But anyway, to be fair. Yeah. So I guess no, this sure. is something that like all kids shows do. Like, and oh, I yeah, think, yeah, yeah. I think kids shows do it to more of extreme than for sure. like doing it in Star Wars. Because I think Star Wars, they are more concerned about the artistry. But a lot of kids shows, it, the reason they're only on for two seasons is literally so they can Reboot burn the through more toys. Sure. And that's like, and yeah, like yeah. That. I mean, like we'll He-Man a being the toy before the movie. And G.I. Yeah. Joe, I guess, yeah. was also the toy before. So, yeah, yeah. There, there have yeah. been things where obviously the toy led. But I think this is obviously the big, biggest budget thing where the toys yes. are leading. Maybe we'll see more costumes because if you think about like for sure, 
Leia has to costume, costume changes. So you're right. You're and right. You have to buy a new figure for each one. Yeah, of yeah, yeah. Costumes. That's so actually maybe true. That's what they'll go with. With because I feel like if you try to split it, I mean, we already know there's going to be a decent amount of main characters. If they're going to try to throw any more in there, that'd be just insane. Yeah, yeah. Like if for okay, so I can see that. So instead of seeing a lot of characters, we're going to see just costume, costume changes on changes. those characters, which I guess well, is you true. already have Finn regular. Finn and Stormtrooper. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. We already, which like we already have Luke regular, Luke and Stormtrooper. Yeah, yeah. So you could just hit all the same. So we'll see Pilot Finn, I guess, <laughs> yeah. and then we'll see Jedi Finn, but I and that'll all. be those will be the Finns. You can I buy hope four every Finns. every new planet he goes to, he just takes off his shirt and puts on a new one, just in front of a <laughs> camera. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I bet there's a lot of people out there that'll agree with that. Oh, because you like John Boyega. He's a handsome <laughs> man. <laughs> he's a handsome man. What's wrong with that? I, I, yeah, absolutely. No, he's I very handsome. Sure yeah, go for it. All right, so I want to take a trip down nostalgia. So not only not only have uh, like the influence of toys changed a lot, but the actual toys have yeah. have changed a lot. Like where we started out with like the the Migos or like like the the Kerner stuff, where it was like There's very no simplified Star Wars Amigos, action no. figures. I hate you so much. Uh, where like. What toys did you like now? And then is there uh, like what toys did, did you like, like then? Like, did okay. you like then? Like did you play with growing up? And also, how w- is there a current type of that toy? And or how did toys change? In my day, is that good? It's my old impression. Nailed it. Um, I guess I could say some of the things I remember yeah. as a kid. And this is just I didn't call my mom before this and ask her. So this is just my. So memory. you don't remember? Okay, so this has not no. been substantiated. Yeah, okay, yeah. Got I it. remember the main thing I had. Uh, I had a, a snow speeder, and it was oh, yeah, pretty yeah. cool because like it was just a legit snow speeder, and Luke was in it. But that I it I it was a Return of the Jedi, black Luke, like black outfit Luke. So I I must it have mixed fit. toys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, the snow speeder was pretty cool because it had wheels, but the wheels were clear. So you would ride on the ground. Oh. And it would kind of look like cool. it was floating. Sure. So I played with that a lot. Um, but then I, with my Luke, I remember uh, I had a Spider-Man and then a mech spider. It was like a, a Spider-Man went into a mech, which doesn't make any sense, but it's okay. That's what, actually what from the mech? Japanese. That's from the Japanese Spider-Man. Yeah. He uh, was like in a giant mech. Robotic. Like it, it looked like a yeah. Gundam. Oh, so we're just not on Star Wars. Well, no, it, it, sorry. Oh, okay. I don't know what Brandon's yeah. talking about, but yeah. that's from what he's t- describing. Oh, okay. It's from the Japanese TV yeah. uh, like, like, Oh, in an ATST or something. Star Wars hybrid. Yeah. Oh, you were you were fight. It yeah. connects. And basically what I would do is I lost Spider-Man. So I just put Luke inside the mech, taped him in there, <laughs> and then uh I took out one of the <laughs> things, I put popsicles, pop sticks. Pop what? sticks? Pop popsicle sticks. sticks. Popsicle, popsicle sticks. sticks. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> and then <laughs> I colored them red and it would spin his arm. So it was like he would he would spin a, a red oh, lightsaber, lightsaber thing. Oh, okay. And he was like a giant mech version of Luke that would spin. That's like dark Darth side. Maul's. That's like yeah. dark side. I love Jedi. that. And then I had uh, a lot. Of, I had a lot of the Nobu from Episode One. A lot of the Nobu. Nobu. Um, Nobu? No, Nobu. Nabu. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, the little uh, <laughs> underwater things. Gungans. What? Yeah, with the, the Gungans. submarine. Yeah, There's all the submarine I had, and then oh, okay. I had a little game. You know those? You know those toys. I just, just okay, a well, list. Like, really, really quick. I just wanted like so. <laughs> what? Brent's <laughs> favorite <laughs> Star Wars toy is a Spider-Man toy with a popsicle stick <laughs> duct tape to it. That is not a Star Wars it toy. It is a Star Wars toy. <laughs> that is not a Star Wars I've toy. I created my own universe of Star that Wars. That was oh my gosh. I'm so scared to oh, ask other people Mike now. Brandon. Kevin, do you have a favorite? And is it actually a Star <laughs> Wars toy? Yeah, yeah. Mine actually is a Star Wars toy. So I loved the uh, the full size lightsaber toys that would Suck like up. telescope. <laughs> what? Yours is actually a Star Wars toy. Yeah, Come, yeah, on. Yeah, Come on. Actually <laughs> answering the prompt. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have enough popsicle sticks as a child, okay? All I had were lightsabers. <laughs> Sue me. Uh, the telescoping lightsaber. Yes, that would yeah, light up and stuff. For I sure. I love those. That's awesome. And the, the lightsabers Sorry, so they, they would, have like, grow. Yeah. Like, you would, like, you could do, like, oh, like the whoosh okay. thing, and it would so, pop yeah, out. Yeah, it was great. It have the different layers. Like and the sure, and the yes. modern the modern lightsabers don't do that anymore. Well, I guess there are a few that are, like, much shorter that do that, that are oh. life-size. But, like, I feel like the modern oh, ones, there, there there are is, is a lot of them, they're just the solid sticks. They do still have stuff that telescopes, yeah. but they are sized down to little kids. Like, I remember those lightsabers. Yeah, they were big. They would be, like, adult-sized lightsabers yeah. you just and give you to would, a little kid. feel so cool by yeah, just yeah, flipping it, was, it out. Yeah, and now yeah. they're kind of... They're miniaturized for the kids, but like for the full size ones, they're actually just that white stick. 
yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. I, um, I, I miss the telescoping ones. So anyway, so my friends or my brother and I would uh, fight with those, and we would break them so often. It was crazy. I think we had like four or five of them by like the end of the time we stopped buying. Oh, yeah. Because so they were so dented, and like there were times like, like it was like we would break them we would yeah, just break yeah, them for sure. we, we wanted to have a lightsaber fight yeah that was the best anyway so that was the that was what we would do is we would play with the lightsaber. yeah when you toys. play where if you got hit with something that arm was now gone yes exactly yeah, yeah. yeah. cuts right LARPing. through that it. What? what that's called larping you were star that's wars LARPing. larping you were star okay wars you know we called it pretend when we were kids okay or just yeah. playing star wars it doesn't have to be larping hey i'm not judging i, know. I am kevin thanks, i'm man. judging thanks man i can always Amanda, count do you have anything no <laughs> um, <laughs> right, I, didn't, that's fine. I didn't have a lot of Star Wars toys, but I do actually remember after watching the Star Wars movie playing with my neighbors yeah. with sticks, and we pretended they were Star or we, they were like. So wait, her but favorite Star Wars toy is Amanda. A stick. That's great. <laughs> so Amanda, that's, that's worse so than cool. me. But Amanda, using that. your imagination, <laughs> that's <yeah>. really good. <laughs> Your favorite Star Wars toy was a Spider-Man toy. <laughs> no, no, it, but it had elements of Star Wars in it, including... It was a Spider-Man toy. The main toy. character of Luke was inside of it. That's, I just am not giving that to you. Are both owned by Disney now? Yeah, I guess. So, so you know what? Now fine. they're both Star Wars it's toys. Okay. Now yeah, everything's yeah. a Disney toy. And <laughs> I think that's about all the time we have on the podcast <laughs> everything's today. Everything's a Disney toy. Everything's a Disney toy. <laughs> that is our final point. Uh, today on the podcast, we had Macalupo. Amanda Alrich. Brandon Winfrey. And Kevin Burke. All right, this has been the JKA Podcast. Go check out JKA Gear for all your sweet Star Wars needs. See you next week. We're out. Woo! Thanks for watching this week's episode of the JKA Podcast, brought to you by jkagear.com. Go check it out for all your sweet Star Wars swag. Today on the podcast, we had Macalupo. You can follow me on at Macalupo on Twitter. Amanda Ulrich. You can follow me at SoAm33. Brandon Winfrey. You can follow me on Twitter at B Winfrey, B-W-I-N-F-R-E-Y. <laughs> Oh. You spelled it right this week. Good job. I All right. Almost thought he forgot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and I'm Kevin Burke. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, at Kevin with a K-E-V-I-N. Sweet. And as always, thank you, Kevin, for producing this episode. Thank you, Kelly, for directing it and being great. Um, if you like us, please subscribe. You can, If you don't like our faces, though, but like our voices, you can go and uh, download us from iTunes. Uh, I believe we are there, SoundCloud as well, and yes. the JKA website. Yes. Go check us out on the JKA website. Uh, we recorded a bonus video. If you liked Amanda's uh, game, we did next round of the game. It's super fun. Guess who wins? You have to watch to find out. Uh, <laughs> and that's it. I feel like we're out. Any other, uh, any other yes. news? Yes. Uh, we are doing a oh, yes. giveaway uh, for Star Wars Battlefront. Check out our other videos or our page for details. Yeah, learn how you can win Star Wars Battlefront. That's it? Is that it? That's it. All right, we're out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>